Hey everyone, it's John Schwabus from policyviz.com coming to you with another PowerPoint tutorial, branching into PowerPoint. Hopefully it's useful to you. Today I'm gonna to show you how to crop to shape. So if you have a picture, I've got the famous Neil deGrasse Tyson here. If you've got a picture, you probably know you can crop it. PowerPoint actually has some pretty good photo tools in here. I'm just gonna show you the crop tool. You know, say you wanna have this, you know, crop down a little bit. You just click crop and you can grab any of these little, um, Again, do hangies is the word I use. If you have a better name, let me know. But any of these little handles, I'm gonna pull this in and I can just crop that down, right? I can crop I can crop this down. But you can also crop this down to a shape. So let's just say you wanted to create a slide where this picture of Neil deGrasse Tyson is not a rectangle, it's not a square, it's a circle. And you might think that's kind of gonna be difficult to do, but actually in PowerPoint, it's quite easy. Um, because what you can do is you can crop to shape. So I'm gonna go here, this little drop down right next to it, crop to shape, and I'm gonna click circle. Now when I click circle here, notice that this is an oval, right? It's not a circle because it's coming from a rectangle. So to get to a square, I have to crop this down to a square first. So I'm going to go to crop, and I'm just going to slide these guys in. I have to do this a little bit manually to sort of get this in. And you can see the height is 3.79 inches, so that's where I'm gonna move down. I'm just gonna sort of eyeball it a little bit. That looks pretty good. Now I've got a square. Now I go to crop, crop to circle, and now I've got a circle. And now I can add a little border to this. So maybe I wanna have it, I don't know, make it red. All right, and make it pretty big. All right, I got a big red circle there. And I've got Neil deGrasse Tyson all in a circle. I can scale this up, I can scale it down. I can change the border, I can change the color of the border, I can change the thickness of the border and get rid of the border altogether. So let's say you had a bunch of Neils together, you've got Neil deGrasse Tyson, Neil Patrick Harris, and my friend Neil Richards. You can put them on a slide like this. All you need to do is grab those photographs, crop them down to a circle if they're not already, or crop them down to a square if they're not already at a square, and then crop the shape and put them into whatever shape you want. I'll go back real quick if I want to undo everything I just did and you are really feeling fun, you can crop this to any of these shapes. You wanna put Neil deGrasse Tyson in a heart, go for it. You wanna put Neil deGrasse Tyson in a, I don't know, put him in a plus sign. I don't know why you do that, but you can do that. So lots of fun stuff you can do here. If you don't know Neil Richards, you really should. Great at Tableau, made one of my favorite annotated line charts of all time, the rise and fall of the name Neil. Uh, you can see some really great stuff here. I'll put the link to this in the show notes so you can check it out and be sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel so you can learn more about doing a better job presenting and communicating your data.